talking about beauty today as you see I'm barefaced I'm on my day off I don't like to wear makeup if I'm not doing much um, or if I'm off for the day just because it helps keep my skin clean and really a lot healthier um, but today I wanted to talk to you guys about my favorite clean beauty products and kind of benefits of them why I've been using them for so long so yeah Let's get started. So the first one I want to talk to you guys about is the Innisfree. It's from Sephora. Intensive Hydrating Eye Roll-On and it has green tea seed. And it's got this really cool roller on it. You just kind of like push up a little bit and you roll it on your eyes. And it's like you don't have to keep it in the fridge to keep it cold because it's already cold because it's like a nice metal. But I, oh wow, it feels so good. I didn't use it this morning. Have had puffy eyes in the morning since like junior high. Like it would be so bad in the morning. And now I know it's because I used like, you know, you're 13 and you're trying makeup and um, starting with all that. But I can't really use drugstore makeup. And I would literally have to stay home in the mornings because my eyes would be so red and dry and swollen. Um, I'd have to stay home from school because I was either embarrassed, it was like, A, I'm embarrassed to go to school looking like this, and B, like, it was bad, and like, I couldn't wear my contacts. But I still wake up with puffy eyes every now and then, you stay out late, you have a couple drinks the night before. This guy is my lifesaver. So I'm going to link all of these below for you guys. Um, but I've been using this for a long time now, and I love it. I love that it's clean. I love that I can get it at my local Sephora or online. But it's just like a nice, refreshing serum. The green tea in it really wakes your eyes up and it just like massages like any kind of drainage you guys need from like the puffiness from the night before. So my next one is also Innisfree. Not sponsored. Well, these were actually from a club I did with them, but I fell in love with the brand and that's why I wanted to share it with you guys. But this is their, it's a water-based um, hydrating serum. Also with the green tea seeds, so these kind of work together when I use them. It's just a really light moisturizer. It's not um, as moisturizing for my skin during the winter, so I have to, I like to use it at night before I go to bed because I don't like using heavy creams and stuff on my skin because I do tend to break out. Um, but, like, I've had this for so long and you can see that I still have a ton of it, um, but it really does help keep your skin glowing especially during the summer and the warmer months when it can be a little bit humid outside i love this guy so my next one is also innisfree it is their can you see this innisfree um lip sleeping mask with green tea i know a lot of people use the laneige or whatever which i also have that one and i love it but this one is a bit more clean for you just having something on your lips that's not um clean and has good products in it you realize that you just eat what's on your lips so you want it to be something that's good for your body and good for your skin and that's what I love about this one and it's also green which is fun but I use it more than just at night um I use it right before I head to work in the morning and then when I get to work my lips are all smooth and ready and then I'll apply um, my lipstick or lip gloss for the day and it really just keeps my lips from getting super dried out um, while I'm at work, which our office is super dry and I walk in and I'm always like screaming that I have static and that it's dry in there, but this one really helps me. So my next one is BioClarity's Clarifying Mask. I think this is my third bottle. I've been using it for a little over a year now. Um, and I use it as a full face mask one to two times a week, depending on how dry um, my skin is or how broken out I am, but I also like to use it lightly like on um, Like if I have a really bad pimple and I'm going somewhere tomorrow that I don't want to deal with it So I'll use it and I'll lightly put it on overnight and I'll wake up and it's so much smaller um, so It's not as red um, But I really do like this 
I've used, I've done two different systems from them and um, out of all their products, this one's definitely my favorite. So for on days when I feel like I've not gotten all my dry skin off my face or there might be like a little extra makeup left over if I didn't cleanse very well, I, now I'm going to say, I don't know if this is, there's probably still items in this um, product that aren't like officially clean beauty, but it is a cleaner version of a toner and I really like it. It's been really working with my skin and it's the Origins, gosh, it's so bright, United State um, Balancing Tonic. This is also my second bottle, so I mean, I don't use it quite every day just because it gets drying if I use toner too much on my sensitive skin, but I also love to use it on my chest, my neck, because your neck is an area that people forget about a lot, and it's good to keep that uh, skin really clean and moisturized, or else, you know, you'll get wrinkles, like, a little too early because some people get those, um, but I love this guy. It's really um, fresh. Makes your face feel really cool in the morning. Add it with my Innisfree stuff and I'm ready for my moisturizer. So my next item is the Type A deodorant. As you can see, it's been through a lot. I'm on my second tube of this as well. And I love this um, scent, the Clean Crisp Citron. It's aluminum free. I've tried so many natural deodorants. Austin's always like, you and your natural deodorants, like, they never like you act like they don't work this one works and it doesn't give me a rash it doesn't irritate me after I use a razor um, I travel with it I love that it's a cream you can squeeze it out of the tube and um, it's got sweat activated technology I also have the scentless one which is kind of nice when you have on like a strong scented perfume and you don't want it to like blend and smell weird together but I really like this one. It prevents odor and protects against, against wetness. Hello? Are you creeping? Come here, Bubba. Join me. And I'll moisturize your feet with my favorite moisturizer. Look at those pretty eyes. The pretty baby. Okay, I have two more products. This next one is, excuse you, can you sit like a dog? Thank you. Is the Trilogy um, Certified Organic Rosehip Oil. And I, this is my second bottle of this. I don't necessarily use it on my face unless I have a dark spot um, from a pimple that was really aggravating or something. Um, but... It's also good for stretch marks, things like that, but I've used it on scars. I have a nasty scar from a nasty fall on my leg, and it's almost two years old, and now it's pretty much completely gone. You can, I mean, my skin will never be the same, but um, I love this. I love it. It's also really good for razor burn, which we all get it. We all know use it so my last one is the prima it's so beautiful this one is a little bit more pricey but i think it's really going to be worth it and i've been trying it out the last couple nights um it's their night magic botanical skin treatment for radiance and balance it is it has 150 milligrams of hemp hemp cannabinoids so they have a lot of cbd based products slowly been getting into that. I know it helps with a lot of inflammation, something that occurs overnight if you are prone to breakouts or have very sensitive skin. You use four to five drops after you cleanse your face and it's nice to leave your face a little bit damp so that it can really um, absorb all that moisture. And I've seen lots of reviews and like it doesn't break your skin out if you're acne prone and stuff like that. And it hasn't broke me out and I've been like really dry right through here lately. And, um, it's really helped. It doesn't have the best smell. It kind of smells like grass or something or like a weird food. But if you can get over the smell, I really think this is going to be worth it. It's probably going to be a new go-to for my skin routine. So that is it. I know I went through a lot. I will, like I said, link everything down below. And 
Um, I'll be talking about these items more on like my Instagram stories and stuff like that. Thank you. Um, but thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have a good week. <laughs> um, but bye.